Hey everyone, it's Jo here. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I make craft videos. I do Poundland hauls and I do an occasional vlog video. If you're returning, as always, welcome back my friends. It's great that you've decided to come back and spend a little bit more time with me this afternoon. As I'm making this, I am four subscribers off. That's only three. I'm four subscribers off. 1,000 and I'm just... I'm lost for words guys. I don't, I consider myself quite a boring person so for near enough a thousand people want to see my videos and my crafts is just a, a little bit mind boggling. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm so, so thankful and I just wanted to let you know that I'm just, I'm just loving life at the moment and it's, it's nice because if you know me, three years ago, I didn't think I was going to be here, so uh, yeah, um, I'm I'm really, 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 really just loving life. So I've got um, some, I've got a Poundland haul, which is nowhere near as big as my Poundland hauls that I've done in the past, and then I've got some charity shop, uh, char charity shop stuff that I picked up. I've got one, two, three, four, five. I've got five things that I got from the charity shop, and they are all absolutely stunning. I don't think I've ever found anything so nice in a charity shop before. So, yeah, I'm going to do that after the Poundland haul. So if you're only here for Poundland, you can watch that. And then anybody who wants to see the amazing things that I picked up um, from the charity shop, then I'll do them afterwards. Um, what did I want to say before I started? Oh, I've now got a Instagram page and I've named it the same as my YouTube channel name. I'll add it across the bottom here and I've had it for a while but I changed the name to match my YouTube channel. I've not got a lot of posts on it at the moment but what I'm hoping to do is the reason that I've done it is because a lot of you keep saying that you know you've made this and I've seen some pictures on Facebook and you, you know the, the things that you've made that I've made and I just want to be able to see everything that everybody's making so I did it so that we could hashtag um, my channel name and then yeah I get to see everything that you've you've made and yeah I'm just really really chuffed that people are making the stuff that I've created so yeah let's get into it. So yeah, nowhere near as much as what I normally get. I've got a few bits that I've picked up before, so I'll just show you them. But the first thing I picked up was another one of the Bottoms Up cocktail bowls. They used to be called fish bowls, these, and then they've changed them to cocktail bowls, so I picked up another one of these. Um, if you've seen the craft video where I used one of these and turned it into a snow globe, um, I picked up another one just in case I decide that I want to do another one of them, so it's better to have one than not. Then I also picked up, and I don't know why I picked up two of these, I probably forgot that I had one already, but I picked up two of the auto spray paints in white, these are in the car section, and yeah, um, I need them for tomorrow's craft, so I will be spraying some stuff after I film this and getting on with that one. And then, I don't know, <laughs> I bought some more of this guys. Um, the metallic acrylic paint in the peacock green. I use this in a craft where I made some stars to go around some fairy lights and I ended up doing about five or six coats of this stuff because it's not very thick and I actually thought when I was making it that I was probably never going to buy any more of this because it was so much of an effort but yeah here we go I've got it in my hands. Um, I just love the colour. It's the colour of my living room um, so yeah, I just thought I might as well pick it up while it was there because every time I go in when I want something, I can't find it. Do you know what guys? They've still not got the craft stuff in my power line, the Christmas craft stuff. I don't think I'm going to get it in mine, um, which I'm really, really upset about. I keep seeing everybody posting all these wonderful pictures of all the things that they're making with the craft stuff and yeah, I'm just not going to get it in. They've not got the miniature trees, they haven't got the pine cones, they haven't got the glass baubles, they've got the holes so you can put stuff in it, which I really wanted, I really wanted some of them. I really wanted some of the miniature trees. I've seen like bits of green garland, um, I definitely, definitely wanted some of that. Um, 
the decoupage paper, the brush set, I've, everything, all the Christmas craft stuff hasn't come in my pound land and I keep asking when I go in, are you getting any more stuff? And they're just like, yeah, we're getting it. It's going to be replaced as we're going. And yeah, now we're near the end of November and um, still not in. So yeah, I don't think I'm going to get it in, guys. So I'm just going to carry on doing what I can with the stuff that they've got in. So I also picked up, and this was the last one that they had, um, I picked up some of the window stickers, and again, I used these on the, I used it on the snow globe, um, I nearly, I think I used nearly enough a full pack, except from three, so I wanted to pick some more up, because I've got a project that I want to be doing next week with them. And on the same note in that line of that, I picked up these, these were new, I've not seen these ones but these are the window stickers as well and yeah I really like these, I thought these were super cute especially the deers and obviously the snowflakes and yeah so I'm going to be doing a craft next week with these and these and yeah um, I'm looking forward to trying that out so I'm going to do two different options one which is obviously more colourful with the new window stickers and then one with the white uh, window stickers as well so yeah really chuffed with these I think these are absolutely amazing Um, then also from the Christmas section I forgot about this I picked up another <laughs> I picked up another one of these Um, yeah not a fan of tinsel so I'm just going to be taking this off and using the base of the cone. Um, I've got two now and I've got two crafts that I want to do. One I need pine cones for and like I said I can't find them. And the other one is going to be for a fairy garden next year. So yeah I'm going to pick up some more of these because... Um, yeah, I'm super excited to do a fairy garden next year. And I've never done a fairy garden before, but after making my little wooden hut yesterday, next to me, after making my little wooden hut yesterday um, and planning on doing a little village, I uh, really like the idea of actually doing a fairy garden next year. So um, I'm going to be starting that probably quite early on next year. Um, just because I'm going to make it quite big and um, there's going to be a lot of detail in it. So I might do a series with that every, I don't know, maybe every week, every week on a Sunday, I might do a little bit of each section of the garden. So yeah, I'm going to get some more of them. Then the only other thing from the Christmas section, I picked up two of the nutcrackers in the navy blue and the green. Um, I tried to pick the best two that I could possibly pick up. I mean, all of them was kind of damaged in some way. So these have got a little bit of paint missing from the top. But I just thought, you know what, I could probably just repaint them. So, yeah, I'm going to do a craft with these at some point. And um, some pillar candles, I think. And some candles and a lot of gold glitter, gold glitter so yeah looking forward to doing that with them then i picked up a few bits from the party the party the um gift section the christmas gift section i actually picked these up last time i went in before i did my last poundland haul but i completely forgot that i had these so um, I thought I'd answer this one. I just picked up one of the rose gold gl glittery sparkle mirrors and this is just a compact mirror. I'm not going to show you the inside. There is a mirror on, there's a mirror on each side. Um, but yeah, just handy to have in my bag. Then I also got one of the glow up liquid eyeshadows and they come like this and this is in a silver they've got them in green and I think they've got them in rose gold as well and um, so I just picked up the silver one as silver and grey is my favourite colour so um, yeah I end up wearing a lot more of that than anything else then I also picked up one of the lip liners and the liquid gloss lip kit and these were a pound um, they had them in a they had them in a dark red as well and I've just read the back and it is against animal testing. Um, 
I can't, I don't know how good it's going to be, but I just thought, you know, for a pound, I will have a play and see what it's like. And then, of course, I couldn't help myself because if you know me, you know I love my nail varnishes. So I picked one up in each of these colours and they're absolutely stunning. I got the red and the silver. And yeah, two for a pound. They're really, really pretty. And yeah, I'm looking forward to using these in the future. So I keep seeing a lot of people saying about Powerman's now changing their price structure um it's going to have different prices some things under a pound some things over a pound um i've not been in to be honest i've not been in the last couple of days so i don't know if mine's changed yet but um i'm quite intrigued to see how it's going to work out as long as they don't put everything up and it's going to end up being really expensive i'm kind of hoping it just pretty much stays the same, except from there's some things that are a bit cheaper. And then obviously they still have the, you know, £5 and £2 items. But we shall see. Um, it'll be interesting to see what they do. But these are the grey ones. So yeah, two for a pound. Really nice. I think they're ideal for a little stocking filler. I'd be really happy if somebody bought me one of these for a little Christmas present. So yeah, um, I just wish they had more colours. They just had the two sets of reds and the silver. And the reason I mentioned about the um, the reason I mentioned about the change in prices, I've been I've been looking at this is the last thing that I got from Poundland. I've been looking at this for ages, and they were in the five pound section, and I kept saying to myself, I'm not spending five pound on it. I just I'm just not spending five pound on it for what it is. Um, and I went in the other day, and it was reduced to two pound, and I'm so happy with it. But I finally picked one up, and I got one of the mini um, post box. And obviously, I'm going to be doing something Christmas related with this. And but as soon as I saw that it had been reduced to two pound, I was like, oh, I'm so happy. So yeah, I picked it up. I don't have kids, so there is no reason for me to buy this other than to do a craft with it. It's not like, you know, my children are going to get any use out of it. That's why I didn't want to pay £5 for it, um, because it is just for me. But I haven't even looked at this yet. I've not even took it out of the, the, the bubble wrap or the packaging. So let's have a look at it. Oh, wow. What do you get in it? This is the post box. I'm really chuffed with it. This is for 18 months and over. Oh, and it is made out of wood. It's already painted front and back. Really chuffed with it. And then you get, <laughs> I didn't even know you got these. This is so cute. If I can get in it, you get a little wooden envelope. Oh, that's so cute. You get little wooden, little wooden envelopes with a little bit on the back. That's really, really cute. So, uh, yeah, really chuffed with that. And, yeah, I'm looking forward to doing a craft with it um, in the next few weeks. So that's everything, guys, from Poundland. Um, quite small for me. I've uh, tried to be watching what I'm spending, obviously, because we're coming up. I'm trying to... I don't know who I'm kidding. I'm trying to watch what I've been send, spending. I haven't spent that much in Poundland this a couple of weeks, but I've spent a fair bit in the charity shops. Um, yeah, um, I'm trying to be good before Christmas. It's not happening. But yeah, I've not been going in Poundland that often. I've been in a couple of times just to pick up a few bits that I definitely need for upcoming crafts and then just picked up the things that I really wanted um, instead of just filling up a basket because it's a pound. So, yeah, that's it, guys, for Poundland Hall, but we'll get on to what I got from the charity shop. So, um, I picked up a few things. First thing I picked up, and I absolutely love these, I got these from the RSPCA. I paid a pound each for them, and I got two. And these are little cherubs. They're plastic, and I am probably going to be painting these. I absolutely love cherubs and angels and anything related that way. I'm like, 
I don't know why, I've always had a really ornate taste. Um, anything like massive gold, candlesticks, candelabras, chandeliers, anything like that, I absolutely love. And uh, yeah, so I'm super happy with these that I picked up. And I don't know what I'm going to do with them, but I know I'm definitely going to paint them. Then the next thing, oh, my leg's gone dead. <laughs> I don't know why I sit on the floor. It's probably just because it's easy to have everything, everything around me. Um, so the next thing I got, I paid three forty nine for this, and I think I got everything. One, two, three, four. The last four things I got everything from the same charity shop, and I think they're all off the same person that brought them in because it is just my taste. Um, so yeah, I think somebody's just had a bit of a clear out, but I've picked up this for £3.49, I don't even think it's been used, it's just got the little pull drawers, like so, and yeah, I absolutely love this, I'm going to find somewhere behind me for it to go, and yeah, I just couldn't leave it there for £3.49, if it had been a fiver, I probably wouldn't have picked it up, but I just thought, you know what, £3.49, a bargain i don't know how much they would have paid for it brand new but yeah love it so uh my colors and yeah really happy with that then the next thing i picked up was two pound 49 and again from the same charity shop i'm gonna do something with this i don't know when i'm trying to find time to fill everything in i remembered what i wanted to talk about this at the beginning um vlogmas i've been thinking about vlogmas so i'm going to do vlogmas i'm not going to film every single day but um i'm going to fit the days that i don't normally upload a video i will do a vlog and then obviously if i'm uploading a video that day i'm not going to do a vlog so you'll get a video every day for me from the 30th i'm going to start on sunday the 30th by putting up one of my trees and up until the 24th so i'm going to do it that way but yeah um Two forty nine. I paid for this, and yeah, I'm really, really chuffed with it. It's got glitter all over it. It's nice and sparkly, and yeah, I'm gonna be doing something with this at some point. Um, and I'm looking forward to seeing how this will end up looking in the end. So it's not a priority. Um, I've got other things that I want to be doing first. Um, before I do that. And then I've got two other things. This I've not taken out of the bag. And these two are my favourite. I'm not taking this out of the bag because... Oh, God, there's going to be glitter everywhere. This is what I went in when I saw them. Um, I paid one ninety nine for four of them. And, yeah, um, they are absolutely stunning. So, yeah, really, really, really chuffed with these. One of them's a little bit bent, needs a little bit TLC, but I think they're absolutely stunning and they're massive and they're going to be going in my bathroom somewhere um, and they're going to be out all year round, they're not just going to be for Christmas. But this is what I saw, I went in and I was like, yep, yeah, I will be buying them and then I saw the little thing with the... Uh, the drawers and then I saw the heart wreath and then um, I saw the last thing behind the counter well two things actually I got two of them and then when I asked how much they were I was completely completely floored about the price um, so cheap and I don't know how much they would have paid for them brand new but yeah I'm really happy with these and um, I absolutely love them I absolutely love them. They're so sparkly and so big and they're just perfect for what I want them for. So um, I think that will be in the new year. I've got a piece of furniture that I'm trying to upcycle that I haven't done anything with yet. Um, and yeah, um, they're going to be for that. And then the last two things I bought, and these are stunning. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. But they are candle holders. Um and they hang, I don't know where I'm going to hang them from, so yeah, I paid two forty nine for them, I got this one, and they're just so pretty, so I got this one for two forty nine, and I've just figured out how you could make one of these, I might do a tutorial on how to make some of these, 
so I got this one and then I got another one which is the same kind of thing but a little bit different I got this one so yeah I'm really 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 chuffed with both of these they're so pretty and yeah they were just behind the till on a shelf and I said just by out of curiosity how much are the decorations and he said the 249 and I was just like yeah I have to have them both um, and really 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 chuffed with these I don't know where they're gonna go I don't know where anything's gonna go to be honest guys <laughs> I've got so much stuff but yeah super super happy with these um, and yeah I think I've just figured out how to make these so I'm gonna do some more of these I'm definitely going to be doing some more of these so yeah look forward to that sometime in the future all right guys that's everything i've mentioned the instagram page i've mentioned my thank you as always um yeah just just thank you thank you so much um yeah i just don't have words and I showed you all the stuff I got from Poundland. I showed you my charity shop finds. And yeah, um, I will see you tomorrow for tomorrow's craft video. I'm making a friend for my snowman. So I'm going to go and spray paint the fish bowls. And uh, yeah, you'll get to see who his little friend is going to be. And then um, on Sunday, I'm hopefully going to be going to my local garden centre. They do a massive Christmas display. Um which is dangerous because I'm probably going to end up buying stuff um, but yeah I'm going to go and have a look for some inspiration and see if um, there's anything worth buying or worth making and showing you how to make it so I'm going to go and vlog that on Sunday and then at some point in the week I want to take you around the shops and show you all the Christmas displays in the windows because there's some really nice ones at the moment in the village so yeah so there we go that's everything I can't put these down I'm just so in chuffed with them and uh, I will see you tomorrow for tomorrow's craft video take care for now everybody bye